Hello and welcome to the final T20 between Pakistan and Bangladesh. The third and final T20 today and I'm going to bring the over by over audio highlights to you. Before we start that we got to look at the teams first. Bangladesh is playing Muhammad Naeem, Shamim has come in, Najmul Hassan, Afif Hussain, Muhammadullah, Nurul Hassan, Mahdi Hassan, Amirul Islam, Shuh Shuhdiul Islam, Taskin Ahmed and Nasu Ahmed. On the other hand side, Pakistan have made quite few changes after winning the series and they have more or less given opportunity to every single player who was sitting out on the benches. Babar Azam captain, Muhammad Rizwan, Haider Ali, Sarfraz Ahmed, Khush Dil Shah, Iftikhar Ahmed, Muhammad Nawaz, Muhammad Wasim, Usman Khadir, Haris Rauf and Shah Nawaz Dhani. Bangladesh has won the toss and elected to bat first. And their openers are ready to come out and Shantu and Muhammad Naeem are, are there on the crease and Muhammad Nawaz is going to bowl the first over. Naeem is facing and first ball been uh, driven towards the long on sink for a single and on the third ball Shantu drives it to mid off for a quick single two runs off the first over. Shanwaz Dhani is going to bowl his first over who has been given cap today and uh, Muhammad Sarfraz has spoken to him and given him the cap before the start of the match. So here comes Shanwaz Dhani and on the first ball to Shantu. Beautiful shot that's taken length ball and it's gone to the boundary for four runs. And the next ball is wide it's gone down the leg side. And the third ball, it's a beautiful yoker on the middle and leg and Shantu wanted to play and he has failed and his wickets are shuttled down. So the first wicket for Pakistan, first wicket in international T20 for Shanwaz Dhoni and Shantu has been clean bowled. Shamim is the new batsman in and on the very first ball he gets down on the knee and hits it to the extra cover for four runs. Good start. Nine runs of the first over of Shanwaz and a wicket. Bangladesh 11 for one at the end of second over. Hamad Wasim is going to bowl the third over. Just three singles of it, 14 for one. Shanwaz Dhani is going to bowl again the fourth over. Single on the first ball. The fifth ball of Shanwaz. It's a short ball on the leg side. Shamim swirls it and pulls it over the backward square leg and that's the four runs. And this time short of length and Shamim opens his bat last minute and it's gone by the keeper to the third man for four runs. Nine runs again of the over, 23 for one. Mohammed Wasim is going to bowl the fifth over, very good and tight line, just two singles of it, 25 for one at the end of fifth over. Haris Rauf is going to bowl the sixth over, very first ball, short ball and this time Shamim cuts it nicely over the covers region for four runs. Nice shot. Uh, four singles after that, 31 for one, 33 for one at the end of six overs, at the end of power play. If Tahar is going to bowl, the seventh over and just four singles of it and that's 37 for one. Here comes Usman Kader to bowl the eighth over and on the very second ball, Shamim wanted to hit over mid wicket but he has failed and the ball is gone straight in the hands of Iftikhar Ahmed who takes an easy catch and that's end of Shamim. Well played 22 for Shamim. Afif is the new batsman. The last ball was a very short ball and Afif pulls it down and there's two runs of it. Two runs and a wicket in the 8th over. Bangladesh 39 for 2. Iftikhar is going to continue to bowl the ninth over. Very good line again. Tight line and very sensible bowling. Just three singles of it. Bangladesh 42 for 2. Osman Khadr is going to bowl the 10th over and on the third ball this time Naeem has picked it up and it's gone over the mid wicket that he has managed to find his good timing and that's a 6. And the fifth ball this time Osman Khadr bowls and it's a full toss and Naeem just clubs it on the onside and that's gone for 4 runs. 10 runs of the 10th over Bangladesh 52 for 2 and that's the drinks break. Iftikhar Ahmed is going to bowl the 11th over and once again very good line in this over. He has managed just three singles and Bangladesh 55 for two at the end of 11. 
Usman Khader is going to bowl the 12th over. And on the very first ball, Afif Hussain has gone down on the knee and has hit a lovely sweep and it's gone well over. And that's a six. Good shot. Very good shot. Another single after that. And on the fifth ball, lovely shot by Afif, but it's gone straight into his, his partner, Naeem, who could not even get away from the ball. It was a powerful shot. And on the last ball of Usman Khader, Afif Hussain is swiped over the low, over the onside and it's gone for maximum. It's cleared the boundary and the fielder. Another six. Second six of the over. 14 runs in 12th over. Bangladesh 69 for two. Tahar Ahmed continues to bowl the 13th over and the very first ball Naeem has uh, played it towards the own side and there's two runs of it. And on the third ball this time, Muhammad Naeem tries to sweep, miss it fully and lucky that his, off, his stumps are still there and misfields by Sarfraz behind the wicket keeper which allows them to take a single. And two more runs after that, five runs of the over. So if Tahar Ahmed has completed four overs, 13 runs without any wicket. Bangladesh 74 for two at the end of 13 overs. Dhani is going to bowl the 14th over. The very first ball, pace ball and Muhammad Naeem has sensibly used the pace. Just played on the last moment and it's gone past the third man for four runs. Very good sensible batting. Good comeback by Dhani after the first ball. And on the last two balls, two singles, six runs of the 14th over. Bangladesh, 80 for two. And on the second ball of Usman Khader, Afif tried to play against the spin over, over long on. But he has only managed to give the top edge, which is going to Muhammad Isban. And he's gone for 20. Usman Khader has stuck in. So the new batsman is in. And Muhammadullah is going to accompany Muhammad Naeem. And in the next ball, Muhammad Naeem plays it down the ground and there's two runs of it. And the fourth ball this time to Muhammad Naeem. And it's in the slot and Muhammad Naeem clears his front leg, open his arms and it's gone all the way over Cork Harner for six. And another single, nine runs and a wicket of 15th over. Bangladesh 89 for three. Hadi Rauf is going to bowl the 16th over. Five singles and a wide. 95 for three at the end of 16. Mohammad Wasim is going to bowl his fi final over. Uh, three singles and a couple. And that's a five runs of 17th over. 100 comes up for Bangladesh. 100 for three. And, sorry, Mohammad Wasim's third over. Haris Rauf is going to bowl the 18th over. And on the very first ball, Mohammad Mohammadullah plays it towards long on. And there's two runs. And the fourth ball has been played to long on. And there's a, two runs again for Mohammadullah. On the fifth ball, it's a short ball by Harris Rauf and Muhammadullah goes for a pull shot. It's just got a bounce and it's crossed the boundary rope for four runs. Ten runs of the 18th over, Bangladesh 110 for three. Muhammad Wasim is going to bowl the 19th over. And on the third ball, Muhammad Naeem wanted to play over the bowler's head and it's taken the top edge and uh, gone back to Muhammad Wasim. And Muhammad Naeem is gone, caught and bowled by Wasim for 47. The fifth ball was a, flow, uh, was a low full toss again on the stumps and Nurul Hassan this time plays it nicely and it's gone to the short final leg for four runs. The last ball of Muhammad Wasim and this time Nurul Hassan cuts it over the third man and it's gone straight in the hands of fielder Usman Khader who takes the catch and it's another wicket for Pakistan. 116 for five at the end of 19 overs. Aris Rauf is going to bowl the last over. And on the very first ball, Muhammadullah is out. He's been catched by Muhammad Wasim. And that's the wicket. Big wicket gone at the deep square leg. On the very next ball, Amin Islam sweeps it to the covers and there's two runs. And on the fifth ball, this time Mahdi Hassan. Mahdi Hassan plays a nice shot. It's gone to the third man for four run. And the last ball of the innings. And... Mahdi Hassan has played and they run and it's Babar Azam throws it to the wicket keeper Sarfaz Ahmed and it's a run out. So that's it for Bangladesh. Bangladesh has scored 124 for 7 and Pakistan needs 125 runs to win. If Pakistan win this match they will clean sweep the T20 series.